So in this video, uh, we are going to learn around data adapter transform. There is one feature or there is one output component of data transform uh, where we can list or we can map it the value of uh, out, output and we can transform those output to some values which we can define it. So normally what the scenario come, so we, we have sudden, uh, let's say for an example we have city is one of the field which where we are getting some values as in Toronto, New York and San Francisco and there are some some values where the city value is not coming from the record so we wanted to send 001, 002 to corresponding cities and that if city is null then we have to send an any value so this, sort of, this scenario normally come in order decomposition or uh, order management scenario but we, we can achieve it by using data adapter transform. So what we are going to do, I'll go for demo org. So this is our data adapter, what it does. I'm just giving some values like A and it gives me some relevant values like, you know, these are the values and these are the billing cities are coming as a Toronto, billing city is New York and San Francisco. And there is a no billing city here. So what's, what what we have to do, if it is Toronto, then 001, if it is New York, 002, if it is San Francisco, then 003, if it is not applicable, then if it is null, then any. So let's go to here, we go to the output. So this is the place. So what we have to do, default value, we will keep it as an any. All right. This is the place, this is the transform value map. So what we can do it, if it is, any, then is going to give you any, another value, um, we set Toronto, copy from here, Toronto to 001, again to New York then we can copy to New York to here 002 then you come here you put San Francisco and then you copy it here 003 now we will run our this is the actual result and this is the outcome so see so nothing is there, then this is, this is 001, this is 002, this is 003, and this is 001. So using transform map values, whatever the outcome coming, whatever the extract output JSON path, which we are retrieving from our database, we can transform those values of input to output, whatever the desired, like if I put it like, Thing. go here that value will be coming despite in spite of the value which is coming from your database so this is the way where we can send the desired result to the external systems or we can utilize that thing 